Okay, so bear with me and thank you. I just realized that I can do this um, live chat. Welcome to live chat, blah, 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 blah. Um, okay, here is the sad pop out chat. <gasps> okay, so here's the thing. I just, on my last video, <laughs> I did like five minutes ago, um, I had people writing to me and I didn't know because I'm learning and please forgive me. I am really, really, really trying. So um, there's a woman who just got uh, diagnosed in March, I think. I am so sorry. It really sucks. I'm like almost six years into it. Yeah, about six years into having PV. And I've gone through hell and back. And quite frankly, I still have no, There, I still am not under control. I mean, I can still go get a phlebotomy every couple of weeks. Um, side note for this one, um, what was it? The, the thingy that I'm going to be in, uh, the clinical trial that I'm supposed to be in. One of them was, um, if you get three, um, phlebotomies within six months, I'm like, I can do that in like a month, <laughs> you know? Um, so it, it's still not controlled, but then on the good news, there are people who hardly, find the effects of it or just go get, um, blood, uh, phlebotomies. I'm so sorry, guys, my brain sometimes, um, like they'll go get phlebotomies and they'll be like every six months or once a year or something like that. So, I mean, there is hope and there is a huge array of how people are affected. Some people, I remember when I first had PV, I didn't know what to do. There was not hardly any information. I am not kidding you. And this is only six months. So there's two ways of this. When I first had PV, um, I knew nothing about it. It was just an old person's disease. It was if you were a man, all of these things. And it was nuts. I was pregnant. I had a really rough pregnancy. I mean, constantly like you're going to die. The baby's going to die, blah, 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 blah. And um, just horrible everything. It was, it was horrible. It was depressing. And then, um, and I didn't really have anyone to see. I then saw a video of this girl and I, I really should hope to share that video with you guys one day uh, where she talked about her dad having PV. And I was like, oh my God, bless you. It's like, it's good to hear your perspective. And I'm sorry your dad had that. And like, what in the world? This is not just your blood. And then I kind of realized, I thought, you know what? I have been looking high and low for any information. And I think it was like two years after, I think I've, I've only been doing this for like maybe two years, I think. I don't know how long I've been doing it, but, um, and I know that it took me time before I could even talk about it. I didn't tell anyone about my pregnancy because we kept getting really, really, really rough news. Um, and then I didn't come out with a PV until later and it didn't hit me fully that this was like a cancer in your blood and blah, 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 blah. Um, so I, I understand it sucks. And in the beginning, it's, it's sometimes surreal. And sometimes it was really good. When I first found out, I was relieved. I was like, oh my gosh, there's a name to this. I'm not going insane. I truly thought I was going nuts. I was going to a neurologist. I couldn't get the headaches out of the way. I was seeing double and it is scary. Um, it, was, it was miserable for me. And I just felt nuts. Um, let me check, see how I find you guys on my chat things. Some messages. Okay. Live chat. I don't know how to do it. Gosh, you guys. I hope that you understand that I'm trying. I'm going to write hi and see if that does anything. Okay. <laughs> Anyhow, um, so I'm sorry that you're dealing with it right now. I don't know what stage you're in. Um, there are times where I just like to think I don't have anything. And, you know, obviously my body whoops me and tells me, yes, you do, <laughs> you know, um, there are people who do very amazing. There are people who don't fare well. Um, I don't know. I think I'm middle of the road. I think I'm one extremely blessed, lucky person, as weird as it sounds. I have a horrifying disease that sucks and it does not just affect your blood. It has hit all of my organs. I've literally had ischemia here. I've had lungs, heart, 
my liver and my spleen and my guts are all wackadoodle and my veins are all messed up. I have all these things. So it's not just your blood, right? Vision big time. Oh my God. Memory and attention, obviously. Um, but all these things have been affected, but I'm here. I don't know a lot of people who say they had a huge clot in their heart and they are alive to tell you about it or the pulmonary embolisms and just now within my liver. I mean, really as horrifying as these things have been, um, I'm blessed. I'm very lucky. And, um, so there's just different perspectives. Don't think I don't get down. I get crazy depressed at times. Um, but also I'm grateful. So that's kind of my thing, I guess. I was like, I don't know what to tell you because I don't know where you're at. I wish you could tell me and like, we could just talk about it. Um, this is going to be rough. I'm going to tell you guys a horrible story also. Um, on the Facebook groups, I have stayed off most of them a lot lately. Um, actually for a little while. Um, I think for me, I am good talking to like select, but when it gets too overwhelming, it's like the walls come crashing and I, I can't handle it. So if there are a lot of comments on someone's, I just kind of let it be and let them do theirs because I think they've probably got the answer. Um, so if it gets overwhelming, I step back. Um, also, I have seen weird, um, I'm trying to be politically correct here because my honest opinion is really rough about it. I've seen adults act like absolute insane children from high school who never got enough attention behave poorly. <laughs> and if you're willing to fight on Facebook, Facebook with someone else who's dealing with an illness, I mean, in a petty way, that just your character sucks. I, I just, that's my opinion. Oh my gosh, Sandra's on here. Yes, 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 yes. Hi, Sandra. I don't know if you can tell that I'm talking to you at this point. So anyway, I'm glad for you. And I'm excited to hear about your appointment when you get to it. Good, good, good. Um, that's so cool. Anyway, <laughs> I got excited. Um, I forgot, oh, Facebook. So I go on there, but I try not to get into other people's nitpicking. I just don't think that's the right place. I think if you're trying to help someone because we have these groups support, love, and care. Don't get crazy. Um, if you met a person and you're like, oh my gosh, are you going to be okay? You see them on the street. They're not doing well. You help them. And then God forbid you believe that you find out that they have a different religion or political view. What are you going to do? Dump them on the street? Like, that's my opinion. No, you're not going to. You're going to be a human. And I think that that is kind of a problem we have online is you know, just dumping people on the street. We don't need that. Whew. Anyway, lots of stuff about that. Anyway, I'm so happy to see you on here, Sandra. I think it, it worked. I saw you. Um, and um, anyway, that was my thing, as I really hope you're doing well. And I'm so sorry I didn't get to your chat um, on the last video because I am really trying. And I don't know how to do all this yet. So um Wow, I just went on. <laughs> okay, now I'm really going to go because I really have to get things done at the house to get it clean and get ready for the bedtime and whatever, 817. Oh, oh my gosh, Sandra, you hear me. Okay, that's so cool. Um, oh my gosh. Okay, well, I do have to go, Sandra, though. Sorry, because it's 817 and I want my son going to bed soon because I don't know. You know, like, I don't know. Like, where does the kid get energy? <laughs> I'm so tired. <laughs> I am so blessed with my son and I love him beyond belief, but I seriously do not know where this little guy gets so much energy. I seriously don't. Okay, I'm going to go. Blessings to everyone. Be healthy and happy and <laughs> seriously take care because <laughs> life is short and enjoy what you can.